Hello, everybody, and welcome to Sonic Labyrinth. This certainly is a game that exists. Not too excited about this one, to say the least, but... Hey, the title screen looks kind of cool, at least. Like how Sonic's just freaking going all around like an idiot. Okay. We got a time attack. Who would want to play that? We got configuration. In the most basic menu screen I've ever seen. We got ten lives. And a sound test. Oh, so, okay. We're just gonna go right into it, I guess. Labyrinth of the Sky. Zone 1-1. One, one. Okay, actually... I mean, I guess this is fine. Why, why is he so slow? Like, he can spin dash. That's like a way to play the damn game. Oh god. You know what? I, I want to kill this thing. Why was this even necessary to create? Who, who, who thought of this? Why? I don't mind slow-paced Sonic games, but if you're gonna make a game with Sonic as the main character, don't make him slow. Obviously, that's... Yeah, known criticism of this game. Oh, wait, there's a time limit? Crap, okay. Um, I'm not gonna mess around here, then. What, what the hell is this? Okay. Okay, you know what? I guess the time limit kind of adds to the challenge, though. So I guess that's kind of cool. Like, it's not fun, but at least it's challenging. It'd be better than if it was easy as crap, because otherwise I'd have nothing to talk about. Bro, I lost all my keys. Don't I need, like, three of them? Okay. Yeah, this is kind of pain, bro. I have to spin dash to get literally anywhere in the game. Because Sonic, you're walking and you might, no, though, there might as well not even be a walk feature. Like, why is this here? Oh, wait, maybe I, I don't know where I'm going. The sound annoys me. Fucking sounds like a frickin' telephone, bro. Okay, I'm gonna go this way. I, I don't know where this damn key is. I need keys. It's just like duh, 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 ringing the phone over here. How you doing, CF? I just played Sonic Trip 2. Honestly, I thought it was a pretty good game. I liked that, um, the, the tracks in that game felt a lot more varied than the first one. Like, they had actual stage gimmicks, and they got a good amount of characters, and the control, I feel like, was a little bit better than the first one, too. Like, that's 350 or 15 kilometers? It certainly didn't feel like it, man. Um, and, yeah, like, the turns I felt like didn't feel as rough as the first one. I hate this game. Bro. Bro, losing this the keys are so is so annoying. No. Honestly, I probably like Sonic Blast better than this. That's because at least there's probably something fun to talk about when I'm riffing on Sonic Blast. With this game, I'm sorry, it's not even funny how bad it is. Like, you're just spin dashing all over a map trying to get freaking keys. That's it. People make fun of Sonic 3D Blast because all you do is run around and get frickin' birds and then maybe there's a special stage and maybe there's enemies to kill. Like, I don't know. That's a bit simple compared to regular Sonic games, but no. This game, bro. And on top of it, of course, they gotta continue the Game Gear Sonic Trench for the third time and have a frickin' epilepsy effect. Even worse than in Tales Adventure. Thank you for ruining everything. <laughs> bro, I'm, like, pissed off now, bro. 
recording in my angry gamer rant Sona over here. <laughs> oh yeah. If you're wondering what the second time of the Game Gear seizure crisis was, it was there's a track in Sonic Drift 2. One of them had like a lightning strobe effect kind of. It wasn't as bad as in Tales Adventure. But I feel like it still might affect photosensitive people. Maybe? I don't know. I just warn people. Just in case, though. Also, Sonic's shoes is orange, and Sonic's color looks like a more, like, indigo-y, indigo baby blue color. So, I don't like that, either. Bad palette. I don't like the Sonic color. It made him orange. I hate it. Also, I hate Tails with blue shoes. I'm sorry. Also, yeah, Tales Adventure is the best Game Gear game. True. And we're talking the best Sonic Master System game, because it had all the same games. Other than missing a couple. Honestly, I don't know. I mean, it has the Sonic 1, it has the Robotnik the Mean Bean Machine, it has Sonic 2, it has Sonic Chaos. It has Spinball. And Sonic Blast. So it's missing like two of the best games that were on the Game Gear. So I guess by process of elimination, I'd still say Sonic 1 is the best Game Gear game. Followed by maybe like Spinball. I don't know. Then like Chaos are to that greatly. But I appreciated how ambitious Sonic 2's levels were compared to Sonic 1. Bro, losing keys sucks. Oh, you can just view the whole stage. Okay, that's kind of neat. No more seizure effect for now. So that's good. Oh, it's in that guy. Okay, I guess when you get down to it, the gameplay maybe is a little fun in some of the levels. But getting hit and losing the keys is annoying as hell. So, I'm not going to say it's fun. I, I want to give the game a benefit of the doubt. Maybe a little bit. But it's still a stupid-ass idea and premise for a Sonic game, so... No, this had no business being a game about Sonic the Hedgehog. I'm sorry. Yeah, it is annoying. But I'm getting a little bit used to it. And I don't mind overhead view kind of games like this. Like, I honestly, as a kid, I liked Sonic 3D Blast. That was a fun game for me. Even though I never got that far. Yeah. Like, I get it, but no, it's a stupid game. Stupid idea. Never should happen, bro. At least not like this. The execution of the idea is just not... Oh, okay. Boss? Yo, bro. It has actual cutscenes, so I guess that's something that's cool. Also, forgot to mention, I'm not playing a Master System version for this one. Because... Like, damn, yeah, some people, some people can't handle 3D Blast, uh, the way it moves, I get that, fair enough, but it was a fun game, for me at least, okay, this guy's kind of hard actually, maybe not so much, I mean, it's basically the same game, they just added, like, shaders and stuff, because it's on the Sega Saturn, like, it looks like the same game, it's just the graphics are a little more high definition. I mean, I don't know, doesn't the Saturn version have the same checkered floor in the levels? I don't know, I guess it, ma it makes sense that it would be because of the checkered floor, but otherwise the levels would look too bland, so I don't know. This guy is kind of hard, honestly. The boss fights are the only, like, actually kind of fun part in this game. I will say that was kind of fun. A little bit. Like, not ideal or anything. Like, not the funnest Sonic thing, but... The game were like that, I'm just beating a bunch of enemies or some crap. Instead of trying to get stupid keys, then... I mean, maybe it would be fun. Oh yeah, now we got annoying stage gimmicks too, I bet. We got the DKC barrels. Bro, I'm underwater now. What the heck? Okay, you know... I'm getting used to this stupid spin dash everywhere kind of thing. It reminds me of... Honestly, the only reason I don't mind it is because this is how I play Sonic Adventure. Like, I just... 
spam spin dash to move in a lot of areas, mostly. I'm used to Sonic Adventure speeding, speeding. Oh yeah, there's only one of that enemy in the whole game, so I'm able to add him to Mudai, maybe, by the way. So that is a fun fact. Oh, where the hell are all the keys? I don't know if I want to beat this. Well, I, I mean, I'll see. But it sucks. Bro, all that to hit this guy? Shit, man. I mean, I might not have time to beat it anyway. I don't know how long this game is. I mean, 40 seconds seems like a good amount of time. I'm like, bro, how the hell do I get up there? Shit, man. How do I get over there? This, this is really annoying. At least there's an arrow telling you which way you're going. Okay, well that bubble hurt me, so I don't know what the hell is going on, man. Bro, how did I lose that? There's only, like, one bubble hole in the level. Where the heck else am I supposed to go? I don't understand this. Maybe this cannon can shoot me somewhere else. No. There has to be more of these, right? I looked everywhere. I tried finding more bubble holes. I couldn't find them. Bro, I looked in the whole level. What am I supposed to freaking do? I don't, really don't want to have to look up a stupid guy to play this damn game. But I might have to. Oh wait, there's one over there. Maybe that's where I need to go. Oh, okay. There's one here. Okay. I'll go that way. Guess that's why they call it Sonic Labyrinth. It's a maze. It's so cool. I like it. It's a fun game. Oh, there's a cannon here. Okay, bet. I don't got time, bros. Okay, maybe I can get the third key, though, if I speed- Oh! The keys give me more time. Okay, I got this. This level sucks. Just gonna say it. Oh, you can pop the bubbles. By spinning into them. Okay, I'm gonna go this way. Aha! Okay, let's get out of here. I'd rather play this than Mario's Time Machine. I'm gonna be honest. I'd also rather play this than Hotel Mario. At least, this is a functional game. This is an actual video game. Mario's Time Machine sucks and is just a bunch of chores that you do. Leaning up to freaking getting the historical artifacts. Like, this is not a good game, but it's at least a game and not... Doesn't feel like I'm just doing chores off a checklist, you know? 
like freaking Universal Theme Park Adventure. That game sucked, bro. I remember when I played that for Back to the Future, and I was just like, why is this even a game? Like, you have to do all these chores just to freaking go on rides. Who thought that was a good idea? Oh boy, we got more seizures. Thank you, Sonic Labyrinth, for being such a great game. I'm gonna put a seizure warning for the whole video, bruh. This game sucks, bro. There's no fixing this, man. I am uh, deeply sorry. It's just not a good game. I'm pretty sure they toned it down for the 3DS Virtual Con- Oh my god, please stop spam calling me random phone number. Okay, okay. Bro, what the hell? Okay, okay, okay. I'm, I'm just a little unhinged on this stream, man. But hey, it's, it's for the funny, so I don't care. It's for the funny. Oh yeah, I should get magic in here or something. Uh, okay, here I go. Boom. Okay, that was a waste of time. That was a dead end. Where's the other keys? Where's the other key? Does he have it? Does this stupid thing have it? No. Bro, I gotta go in the Scooby-Doo doors to figure out where the hell I'm going. Bro, the spin dash sound is annoying as hell. Okay, nothing there. Oh my god, this sucks. Oh, I got speed shoes in a game where you're slow as hell, so it doesn't even matter that much. Bro! Oh, the speed shoes is what's causing the stupid ass strobe effect, bro. Where the hell is the damn key? I'd rather play Bugs Bunny Crazy Castle than this crap, man. Okay, maybe that's actually not true. I don't know if Bugs Bunny Crazy Castle is this fun to make fun of, but I mean, I don't know. I'm just thinking of a random game. No, I can't find this key. Where the heck could it be? Bigs Rigs Over the World Racing would be more fun. At least I can mess around in that game and go over the hills. Like, that's a thing I can do. It's like a sandbox game, bro. Where the heck is the key? Okay, it has to be in one of these doors. I swear to God. I'm running out of time. Wait, this is like an identical looking area. Let's go, I found it. Of course, it's, it's a maze, so everything has to look the damn same. Like, I thought this was just the same exact area. How was I supposed to know, man? Bro, the damn water ruined everything. Oh, that's not the end of the level. Damn. Shoot. What is even- what even is that? Jello? Where the heck's the exit? Yeah, true. Oh, oh, is this the end? No, it's a timer. This is so cringy. Bro, where the hell is the damn gold man? Bro, 
what the heck? That brought me to the start of the damn level. Are you kidding me? Does this even make any sense? Okay, here's the goal. I... When did I lose the damn key? Are you kidding me? Okay, I don't even know where it is now. I hate this game. Bro. No. I had the key, and then it disappeared. No! I don't even remember how to get to it now. This game's awful. Okay, here we go. Oh, okay, it was right near where that key was. I'm kind of silly. But I'm still rightfully mad at the game, bro. Damn, I got like... 30 minutes. Will I beat the game in time? I don't know. I feel like there's only like four worlds or some crap. Each minute takes like two, min two minutes to beat if I'm lucky. Okay, I didn't know something would randomly hit me. Goal. Bro, I hate navigating these stupid levels. I I'm sorry, I lied. This game is horrible. Hate it. Okay, got that key. Getting the keys is kind of neat sometimes, but no. Nah, maybe, maybe there's, like, a small sand pocket of enjoyment, like, here and there, but no, it's still not fun. I'm just trying to have fun, bro. Trying to have fun. Spinning around, I mean, it reminds me of Sonic Adventure, which is a better game, so, like, I guess that, that's fun. I mean, it's fun to spin around, but, I mean, that doesn't make a good game. How the hell do I get this? Okay, oh, oh, cannon. Boom. Oh yeah. Fun for like two seconds in certain parts of the game, but like otherwise, no. Getting hit sucks so much ass. I'm gonna use safe states on this game. I'm not recollecting the same damn keys. I got it once, that's good enough, bro. Oh, the third one's right here. You know why that exists as a gameplay feature? To pad the damn thing out, because the, th the game's probably not even that long. Let me tell ya. Okay, this level was short as hell. I'm, I'm good. I'm gonna... Maybe I can beat this game, guys. I don't know. Oh, that's the freaking start. I gotta find the goal, too. That's... Fun gameplay. I love freaking bouncing around like an idiot across each level. Fun gameplay, guys. I like how it just says the speed. Like, it even matters at all. Wait. Oh, wait. No, this is a boss. Right? Yeah, boss. Oh yeah, I gotta get a lot of rings if I'm gonna fight a boss. Hopefully, it's as fun as the first boss. Also, something I kind of like at least is that the bosses are all unique, and they're not just Eggman people. I feel like that's a running trend with the Game Gear Sonic games. Most of the Game Gear games don't have Eggman in a mech type bosses. They try to be more distinct from the Genesis games. Oh, I got an extra life. That's cool. I like that. Makes them a little more memorable. Not that I mind Eggman fights though, those are always cool. 
Bro, that thing sucks at Sucks! What the heck is this? You're just gonna throw an enemy at me at the start? Just like that, man. Oh, I can only hit him when he has his... Wait, what the shit? Okay. Okay. You can only hit him when he has his shell open. Is that right? Okay. Why is any of this necessary for the damn fight? Okay, this boss sucks. I'm sorry. They dropped the ball after boss one and made it not fun, so... Less to compliment from this game. No more fun bosses. Where you're just allowed to d just die now. No more fun. Fun isn't allowed. We have an annoying boss for you. Bro. What is this? How the heck do you... You're supposed to hit him when it's open, right? That's what I thought. Because that would make sense in a good game. But no. I don't even know how to hit the damn thing. I mean, I'm guessing just hitting him like that works. But I don't know. There's no hit sound. Okay, well, maybe that's the hit sound. I don't know. That's the most dinky-ass hit sound I've ever heard, bro. Even more dinky than Triple Trouble's hit sound. Okay, you know what? This is kind of cool. I like bouncing around like any in this stage, at least. Okay, I got the sh I got the tactic. Just bounce around like an idiot. Boom. Boom. Okay. I got this. Boom. Okay. Yo, you, you got a Chaos Emerald? I guess that's in this game, too. Man, this is so much... Um, the music is annoying, too. By the way, Emerald Ocean has the best music in Sound of Drift 2, I'm just saying. I don't know if you've played a lot of Drift 2, but it's fun. It's a fun game. Oh god, that's gonna be annoying as hell. Do all the levels in this game have the same damn music? I feel like I've heard this same song like ten times. Okay, at least there's a key right there. Progress. Yeah, the level looks cool. I'll give it that. It's not just a boring checkerboard. It's like, uh... True. Best one so far. It looks, it looks cool. I'll give it that. What? Oh! <laughs> Bro! That is brutal! There's a straight up, like, Mortal Kombat pick with spikes that Sonic just falls into and freaking dies, man. What the hell? Fatality. Okay, that's annoying. Bro, stop! Okay. Key number two. Actually, I should probably go into the thing again, just in case. No, just bring key back. I just wanted to check. You know what would make this game funner? If I could actually jump. Maybe that'd be make it a little more fun. But no, all spin and no jump makes me a dull boy. Bro, where the hell is the damn key? You kidding me here? Do I have to kill that guy? Yeah. Most of the time, they're not in enemy, so... Yeah, I went on that at least once, and there was the one, uh, key there. Okay. Oh, that's the start. 
Okay, you know, it's fun to spin up the slopes. I like that. That's that's a game that's a gameplay feature. Bare minimum fun. Spinning up a slope is fun. There, that's the one thing that's fun about this game. Otherwise, it is pretty miserable. There's like a semblance of you know kind of fun to spin around kind of ness in this otherwise, you know, coded and garbage game. So hey, at least I can kind of have fun with it in, in spurts, regardless of its quality, man. Feels like I might beat it, honestly. I just, I might have to push a little further, I don't know. Now I'll beat Belder with freaking death again. Wait, what the hell? Okay, I, I really don't understand this. So, is it just not working? Is that a bank? I don't get it. What the hell? What kind of shitty ass level design is this? Hey, let's put a thing there that looks like the real one, but it just breaks open. That's so cool. Bro. Oh, I get it. That's only a one-way, um, disc thing. I understand it now. Still, though, it wasn't really clear to me at first. I get it now. Key number two. Okay, this level's easy enough. At least it has less annoying levels. So, I guess that's a good thing. It's not fun, but like, hey, this level was easy, so I'll give it that. Boom. I'm already done with Zun. Uh, Zun. Zun. I said Zun. I'm already done with Zone 3 almost. Hopefully, I can keep it up and try to beat the game before, you know. What I was estimating the, the exact length of this game to be is like 40 minutes or 45 minutes or something, but I don't know how long it is. I like the music though, in certain parts. Like this song's alright. Oh, cool. I almost fell for that shit again. And I almost went into that lightning. Okay. The, you know, the later levels in this game are better than the earlier levels. I will say that. Like, this... So far, there's less annoying-ass enemies and less annoying doors. Like, at least there's no stupid maze doors now. Like, I can just go around the level like a normal person. Instead of having to worry about some stupid... gimmicks. I mean, we still got the labyrinth. Kind of crap, trying to figure out where the hell I'm going, but hey, at least it's less annoying, like, I get to actually play the game instead of going through doors. Still not very fun, but like, it gets a little bit better by like, 2%. Okay, this is another key. Boom. Oh, there's two things here. I'm gonna go on this one. My gut's telling me this. I don't know, though. Do they just go to the same thing? What, what the hell is the point of this? Are you kidding me? Why? What, why is that there? Please tell me why that is necessary other than to waste two seconds of your time. That is the stupidest crap yet this game is pulled. Okay, I don't know where the third one is, but there's gotta be a way over there, man. I don't know, I don't really see much more to this level other than the... The area I just went to. I'm gonna check the Paul screen, though. Maybe I can find a clue. Yeah, the next key is definitely up there. Wait. Wait. No, 
there has to be some kind of trick to that. There's no, they, they can't just be there for no reason, right? What the hell is this for? You gotta be kidding me. Then why is there another one up there? There's gotta be a way, damn it. No, I don't, okay, this level sucks ass. Sorry. I'm gonna look it up, probably. If I don't find what I'm looking for in like another minute or so. Now, it would be cool if I could go across the pit like that, but I can't. No. Of course, the game has to be not fun. No. I'm, I'm looking this shit up. Okay, level 3, 3, I think? I don't know. Oh, sorry. Wait, what the hell? Are you kidding me? What? What? Okay. That was there the whole time. Because, I, you know, I was supposed to know that. Bro, what kind of shit is this? I mean, I guess there is a small pit next to where that level is. That's the one small hint you have, but like, it isn't really that obvious. So, um, screw that, man. Okay, I didn't mean to go that way. Bro, that sucked. I had to look up a video for that, bro. Wasted like two minutes of my life here. Oh, more. At least the goal is right next to the start.